Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Driving with Mitch. I'm in Dubai and I didn't actually want to make a video because I think it's just real cheesy to uh, to make a video in a car like this. You can probably tell I'm, uh, I rented a Rolls Royce Ghost for the day and just kind of cruising around and experiencing some nice things here and yeah, the whole trip has kind of been uh, a real lavish experience for me. And then I thought, well, I don't want to make a video, so that's probably why I need to make one. Because I'm all about doing things that challenge me. And, um, yeah, the reason I didn't want to make one is because I didn't want to be judged for wanting to enjoy nice things. See, uh, in our culture, we're constantly told or um, brought up that it's, you know, be embarrassed about, you know, wanting to have nice, fancy things in life. And uh, you shouldn't want... You know, to be wealthy or you shouldn't want to be able to have the freedom to go and do whatever you want because uh, people might actually judge you and I think that's just a load of absolute horseshit. like fuck that fuck what people think because um yeah people are always going to judge no matter no matter what happens and a, a buddy of mine Mitch Miller actually posted about this the other day and he um yeah, he said that a lot of a lot of marketers, a lot of uh, business people, they'll post something like this, like in a in a lavash car. Let me just kind of show you for a second. Like it is beautiful. It doesn't have any fuel left in it, and um, yeah, it's it's just immaculate. But um, let me just hold that out. Yeah, Mitch, Mitch said something that really hit it, hit home with me. A lot of times, people buy some new shoes or buy a new watch or something and they've done very well in business. And the main reason they've had the prosperity to be able to buy the nice things is because they've served a lot of people, or provided a lot of value to a lot of people, and therefore it's made them a lot of money in return. And yes, you can see the sparkly, sparkly roof as well, which is really, really cool. Um, wow, it's so difficult to drive in Dubai. There's like cars that just pull out and stop randomly. And how, how's my ADD going? Look, squirrel. <laughs> Um, Mitch, Mitch Miller said, uh, a lot of times these people who achieve great things, they go and they say, oh look, I'm here in my garage, and they try and make fun of um, Ty Lopez and, and the way that he um, he talks about his Lamborghini and his Hollywood Hills house, to, to try and soften the blow that like, oh, I'm not really like him, I've just, you know, temporarily bought some nice stuff. And um, yeah, I actually posted on, on that post of Mitch's that... I will be posting very nice photos in the Maldives and um, lavash scenes in this, in the in in Dubai and, and the different experiences I've had, and I've pretty much done that the whole time. And um, the main reason being is because I'm generally very, very how do I put it? Very, I wouldn't say quiet because I'm I'm the, probably one of the loudest mouths on social media that most people know, but. I don't post a lot about my life anymore because of uh, various things that have happened over the last couple of years that have made me not want to do it for, for very various different reasons. So, yeah, I guess I guess that's the me that's the purpose of this video is be proud of who you are, be proud of your achievements, be be proud of being able to afford nice things or being able to to splurge on on nice things when when uh, you've created a lot of value. As you know, we, we have created, between uh, Dirk, Derek and myself, we've created two Facebook groups that have over 32,000 people in them. Um, we've helped over a thousand customers buy crypto in the last uh, three or four months. And um, yeah, our goal for 2018 is to create a thousand millionaires. Now that's a pretty advantageous goal. Is it gonna be possible? I sure as hell hope so. Uh, but there's a lot of work between now and now and then between um, for, to make that happen. So um, that's pretty much it. I'm, we're, this is the last day that we've got here in Dubai. Hence, wanting to have a nice car, uh, cruise around. We've literally just been cruising around, grabbing some lunch, and uh, yeah, just experiencing the the sights. The thing's amazing. Like I, I'm a big car guy, as you know. And there's a few times I've just booted it or planted it from the lights, and the nose just like lifts up like this, and the arse squats right down. Um, pretty amazing twin turbo V12, three and a half ton tank. <laughs> yeah, very very cool. All right, that's it for me. I will um, definitely be making sure I, t I take some videos in, in uh, the Maldives 
we got a drone for that. There's going to be a lot of a lot of opportunities for for some really cool footage. So um, that's it from me. I'll I'll speak to you guys soon. I'll see you in the next video.